It's Thursday, December 10th. I'm Mark Peterson, and welcome to the uh, the feed, letting you know what's happening in our weather. <clears throat> right now, we're sitting at 32 degrees with overcast conditions. We're going to continue to see that uh, throughout the day. Uh, for outside activity, <clears throat> maybe a sunbreak. 37 at noon, our high today is going to be 40. All of that above average. Our average high this time of year is about 32, so... That's not so bad, but the four things you need to know heading into this uh, Thursday is the fact that we're going to have patchy freezing fog. Today is going to be cloudy. Uh, we are going to see light snow coming in tomorrow, and then more snow coming in next week as early as Sunday. So uh, yeah, things are going to be changing. Tis the season. Our current visibility showing fog into the West Plains, patchy freezing fog. So please use caution on those untreated roadways. We've seen this uh, all of last week and again this week. Take it easy. Please allow for extra time in your travels. Now, we look at what's going on with the Northwest Satellite and Radar. It's cloud cover for the most part, but we start to see over in the west a, a buildup of thicker clouds, and there is going to be moisture in this. And it's going to take a while to get here, but it looks like tomorrow morning we're going to see that potential for the potential of snow. One to two inches possible. 40 for our high today. Uh, we're going to be near 40 in Coeur d'Alene, mid-30s Deer Park, and around 40 in Moses Lake and Pullman. So, Again, early morning temperatures are going to tell us that we could see some patchy freezing fog. So 40 today, we're going to see again uh, patchy freezing fog uh, potential tomorrow morning. And then temperatures in the mid-30s Friday, Saturday, even into Sunday. Friday and Sunday, the best two days to see some snow. And again, we're talking lower elevations during the commute on Friday, the morning commute. And again, potential of one to two inches. So we're going to keep an eye on that for you. We thank you for watching. This First Alert Weather app has radar in it. Shows you where the rain or snow is. And it's in the App Store. It's perfectly free. Download it. Put it in the palm of your hand right there in your device. Phone, iPad, whatever you'd like. All right. Have a great day and be safe out there.